Welcome to the demonstration video on transcription and time codes. For demonstration purposes, this short video will cover the most essential information you will need to create a simple verbatim transcript. A transcript is loaded into Transana in read-only mode. To begin transcribing, we need to press this button in the document window toolbar to put our transcript into edit mode. Transana offers you keyboard shortcuts that allow you to control media playback from the document window, which allows you to transcribe easily and quickly. There are four keys in a row that control media playback during transcription. These keyboard shortcuts are the same for video and audio files. On Windows, hold down the control key to use a keyboard shortcut. On Mac OS, hold down the command key. Control D on Windows or Command D on Mac OS starts and stops media playback. Playback starts whenever you last stopped it. Control S on Windows or Command S on Mac OS rewinds the media two seconds before starting, giving you a little bit of overlap with what you've already heard. This little overlap can help you confirm what you heard and keep moving forward. Control or Command A backs the media file up by 10 seconds and starts playback. Control or Command F moves the media file forward by 10 seconds and starts playback. These keys are useful for moving around in larger chunks during transcription. I'll take a moment to transcribe this short video. Anytime I press a shortcut key, I'll say the key combination out loud so you can hear it. Control S. The moment that made me switch from a PC to a Mac. Control S to stop. Control S. PC to a Mac. I'm sleeping. I have to be up early the next day. Control S to stop. She's got Control a paper. S. She needs to print it every time she tries to print the computer crashes. Control S to stop. Control S. She tries to print the computer crash. Computer and the printer, they just weren't talking. Control D to stop. Ask it to do. It does. My name is Bill Swan and I'm a dad. The demonstration version of Transana limits the amount of media that you can transcribe. The full version allows extremely long transcripts for media files that are several hours long. Verbatim transcripts give us a representation of the verbal content of our video or audio file, but this transcript will be much more useful if we link it to the media file by adding time codes. A time code is simply a mark that links a particular spot in the transcript with a matching spot in the media file. We'll move back to the beginning of the media file and the beginning of the transcript, and I'll show you the simple three-step process for inserting time codes into your transcript. First, I'll play the video and stop it at the end of the speaker's first sentence. Control D. The moment that made me switch from a PC to a Mac. Control D to stop. Second, I'll place the cursor in the spot in the transcript that matches where I paused the video. Third, I'll press Ctrl T on Windows or Command T on Mac OS to insert the timecode linking the position where the video is paused with the cursor position in the transcript. You can see a red symbol appear in the transcript to mark the position of the timecode. I'll now continue through the whole video pressing Ctrl D or Command D to start and stop the video, clicking in the matching spot in the transcript and pressing the shortcut key to insert the timecode. Control D to start. I'm sleeping. Control D to stop. Control T to insert the timecode. 
Control D to start. I have to be up early the next day. Control D to stop. Control T to insert the time code. Control D to start. And someone starts tapping me on the shoulder. Control D to stop. Control T to insert the time code. Everything we ask it to do, it does. Control D to stop. Control T to insert the time code. Control D to start again. My name is Bill Swan and I'm a dad. Now that the video is transcribed and time coded, I'm going to get out of edit mode and back into read only mode. When I play the video, there's a highlight in the transcript that moves along with the video. The moment that made me switch from a PC to a Mac. I'm sleeping. I have to be up early the next day. And someone starts tapping me on the shoulder. It's my daughter. She's got a paper. She needs to print it. Every time she tries to print, the computer crashes. The computer and the printer, they just weren't talking. Opening. We can move to any section of the transcript and play the corresponding video just by right-clicking in the transcript. This may sound simple, but it's really powerful when analyzing video data. The Mac has been a dream. Every time she tries to print, the computer crashes. It's my daughter. She's got a paper. She needs to print it every I was a maintenance man in my own home. Now, we're ready to move on to the next demonstration video about analyzing data in Transana.